everyone, my name is Madeline. I am making this video kind of as an introduction to introduce myself and let you know one, why I'm in a wheelchair and two, why I make videos. So I've been wanting to do this for eight years now. I was in a motorcycle accident eight years ago and it left me paralyzed from the waist down. So my spine severed at around T5, uh, paralyzed me from the waist down and I am a complete. So I do not have any feelings below my belly button and I am not, I, I'm not supposed to gain so much any feeling below that. I've gained a little bit, but I, when I say a little bit, I mean like inches. <laughs> I can't feel anything below my belly button or move anything. And it's been like that for the past eight years. Uh, I don't know if anything will ever really change in the future. Uh, there's a lot to, to be determined and things are being invented so you never truly know. So my biggest goal until then is to keep my body fit and as strong as possible. So I do things like yoga, I have a standing frame, uh, different exercises. There's an FES bike, it's electrical stimulation that I've used in the past. Um, I was on the back of a motorcycle with a friend of mine and we ended up going off an embankment and I fell numerous feet down and when I landed that's what the fall falling so far down and so hard is what severed my spine. My lungs had collapsed and I had two blood clots bleeding in my brain and I also suffered from a traumatic brain injury. That's been something that I still deal with. Not very dramatic of a brain injury but it still leaves little holes in my brain that I have to learn tricks to kind of get around it. Like the short-term memory of leaving food out, forgetting to take my medications, or missing appointments, or just not leaving in time to make that appointment on time. Things like that. I've had to come up with a lot of different tools to use to make those kind of things easier. Um, and not fail at them as, as much. I, I have been wanting to start making these videos for so, so long, but it took me forever to finally just record something. And then once I did, I posted it and then soon blocked it, made it private. So I'm finally now at a place where I can record these videos and learn how to edit them, which I will tell you is very difficult, <laughs> and at least post them and leave them out and get the feedback from you guys, the comments, the suggestions, the questions, and be able to provide you with my best answer. I can't say anything that I do or say is the, the result, the best result or the best solution. It's just my solution. It's my recommendations. It's my tips and tricks and so I want to get your guys's questions and feedback so that I can provide you more with these videos. I'm really doing it more for you know myself to be able to look back on and to help you guys because whether you're disabled or not it helps you with the knowledge from someone who is disabled so you can kind of get a better idea and if you are disabled, get those tips and tricks and just kind of see the other world that's out there. Um, I know when I got in my accident, YouTube was a huge thing for me even before my accident. And so once I got into it, after my accident, once I, you know, was paralyzed and in a wheelchair every day, all day, I was looking on YouTube for the kind of questions that I hope to answer for you and more. So when I was looking for those videos, I honestly didn't find much. I don't know if it was just my search questions that I typed in didn't really bring up much of anything, but now I know there's so, so much more out there and I think that's amazing. And so I just wanna be a part of that, a part of that video or that ch channel, um, that will, you know, pop up when you when you look up different kind of questions that I hope to answer. 
So thank you so much for watching this introduction. Um, I know there's so much more I could add. <sighs> like I'm, I'm 28 years old. I live alone. I've lived alone for the past two years. It took me, you know, seven, six, five, <laughs> what? I can't do math. It took me about five and a half years to finally live alone. I do have a job. I have worked at a Buffalo Wild Wings in the past. I am now an assistant, so I only work three days a week in kind of an office environment. To be an independent contractor and write my own schedules and things like that. I do love the environment of a restaurant like Buffalo Wild Wings. Before my accident, I worked at Red Robin. So I, I love those kind of people and, you know, the people I work with and the environment of, I don't know, that fast pace kind of go, go, go. That's definitely my personality. I, I love to do adventurous things and kind of try new new stuff. Um, and I've been trying to do that as much as possible since I've been in a chair. So I have a lot of experiences that I can share with you and um, kind of recommend, uh, I don't know, give you my tips and suggestions on what I did and uh, what I want to do. Uh, there's still a lot out there that I can't believe how much I'm saying, uh, 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 uh. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to comment any of your uh, questions or... So annoying. Thank you so much for watching. Please... Ugh. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed and stay tuned for the next video. Please comment down below. If you want to keep up with my videos, go ahead and subscribe, thumbs up, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.